Hi, I'm John Shipley with the St. Paul Pioneer Press. I'm here with Twins reliever Jared Burton, who uh, really has been terrific this year. One of the Twins have made a lot of good off-season acquisitions, and certainly Jared's been one of them. But I also hear that he's the best guitarist on a team with a lot of guys that play guitar, right? Yeah, we do. We have quite a few guys that travel with them. Uh, me and Blackburn play a good bit on the road together, okay. and he's pretty good. He does some lead stuff pretty well. So we. We got a few guys that take them with, and I take mine wherever I go because it's just uh, it's kind of my thing. When I during the day I sit around in the hotel room, relax, listen to music, or play music. You are the few guys that'll bring a, a full size on the usually. Yeah, the yeah. The other guys uh, bring their little mini strapped on their back, you know. But uh, I had this one custom made a couple years ago. It's kind of my pride and joy. All right, so um, Jared has agreed to play something for us. So. Yeah, I, I enjoy the classic rock stuff, so uh, play a little ramble on. Go ahead. When did you start playing guitar? I got my first one uh, Christmas 03, so January 04. I've been playing a little over eight years now. Okay, and did you teach yourself? Or yeah, you... it was just one of them things, man. I've always always been a big music fan, especially when I got to college. I just started listening to all different kind of music, and then once I got into pro ball, that was just my, like uh, my, when I would have my long time, relaxed time, I would always like to just listen to music, and I just felt like I, I heard it differently than, than most people, just because I just always loved it, and I would always find myself you know, strumming along, you know, with my with my hand, and and when I got a guitar, the rhythm and everything just kind of came natural to me. My first guitar I ever had is a nice guitar. It's an Alvarez, but uh, my grandparents got it for me for Christmas in 2003. So I didn't really get to pick it out. It's still a great guitar and I, play, I still play it a lot, but uh, I just kind of want it as a gift to myself. I kind of wanted to make, make this one my own. It's a Phoenix model guitar, which is a, which is a mythical bird, uh, resurrects itself. And I had the Japanese symbol for immortality put down the neck. And one of the cool things, it's got the, got the red trim and then the tree bark look on the back. Gives it a cool, cool, unique look, and uh, it's got great, great tone. That, and once I saw I was, I was kind of learning pretty quickly, I just devoted a lot of time to it, and it just got better and better, and it's always been a a relaxation tool, you know. I used to used to play video games a lot, but now I don't I don't do any of that now because all the all my spare time I'm you know I'm either listening to music or playing music, and it's uh it's almost like a spiritual thing for me. Just kind of it's my and, and music's like that to me. Like everybody has their own taste. Uh, that's why there's so many different types of music out there. You know, there's it's it's kind of like movies too. I mean, some people will love, some people love this movie, some people hate it. But uh, music has kind of its own own uh, quality to me as far as how people identify and how, how one song, 10 people can hear it 10 different ways. And 